Go listen to what Miss Peter says. Listen to what she says. Go listen to what Miss Peter says. Listen to what she says. She says. Hello everybody, it's Peter here from Face Aerobics. Thank you so much for having a look at the videos. I always appreciate everybody who has a look and uh, even has a go of the exercises. I really do appreciate it. And to all of you out there who are doing the exercises regularly, good on you. I'm so proud of you. And I just think it's such a wonderful thing that you're doing for yourself. And I'm sure that you're starting to feel the benefit of it. Even if it's just the emotional benefit of first, very, very soon you'll start to see the physical benefit. Now, today it's Motivation Monday, and I wanted to talk to you about a question that I get all the time. And this question is, when will it start happening? Okay, this is the question I, this is the top 10, number one question out of 10 questions I get all the time. When will my face start changing? Now, it's a really interesting topic because basically we're doing all this work on our face and we think it's not changing. But the reality is, the day that you start your facial exercises is the day that your face starts changing. And that is the reality. The thing is, is that you look at yourself all the time. And some people, you know, uh, some people see things like, you know, if something comes up on my face, I'll see it right away or a mark or something like that. But other people tend not to notice those sort of things. And basically, what you need to do is to not worry about when it's going to start happening. That is really like the end end part of the journey is when it starts happening. What the best thing about this journey is what's happening to you while you're doing the exercises. Because as, you, as I've said, as you're doing the exercises, your face is changing. Every day you do those exercises, you're getting closer and closer to a wrinkle getting smoothed out. You're getting closer to so many more things. But the problem with us is that we have such an instant society. And it's not like, for instance, you know, I've, I've sort of been thinking about this question a lot and I've been thinking, why are people asking me? You know, it just happens. But the, the thing is, because we have an instant society, look, we can go to a doctor, we can go into the hospital, get booked into the hospital for a facelift, we go and have the facelift, we come out, our face is instantly lifted. That's what a facelift does and that's the benefit of having a facelift, is that it happens immediately. The thing is, is that when you're doing facial exercises, just like any other exercise on your body, it takes time. But if you go to the gym, the first day that you go to the gym and start working out, you are getting benefit from that first day. So I want you to realize the same thing's happening on your face. No matter what you're doing, every time you do facial exercises, your face is changing and your face is getting into a much useful position and your face is changing. So what I really would encourage you guys to do is that not to worry about how long it takes. What I would encourage you to do is to start looking at the journey that you're going on. Start thinking about how great you're starting to feel because that's all part of it as well. I, I always talk about that. That's the feeling that it gives you because it gives you so much more confidence. And when that first person asks you about your hairdo or about um, have you lost a bit of weight or have you got different makeup on, when you get that first question, you wait you'll know immediately that there is changes starting to happen. You really will. So I've had people tell me recently that um, somebody's hairdresser, she went to the hairdresser and the hairdresser asked her if she was wearing different makeup or something. It was something like that that the hairdresser had asked her that she noticed that she was looking different. But you see, they can't put their finger on it. They can't look at it and go, oh, you're doing facial exercises and your face is looking younger. They don't know that. They just think you're looking fabulous. And that's when you get that question, that's when you know things are really starting to change. But until that point, don't lose faith, but just keep going because you've, you've got to get to a point where people do start asking the questions. All right, guys, so just try to stick with it. Keep going. I have people tell me they've fallen off the wagon or, you know, they haven't got to doing them or whatever. Just, just keep going. Just even if you have fallen off the wagon, just start again. It's as simple as that. It's not like you have to go pay for it or go to the gym again or, you know, you, you can just start them again. So if you feel like that you have lost motivation, if you feel like you've fallen off the wagon, if you feel like you, you don't want to do it, just do it. 
And I can totally, totally assure you that you'll want to keep doing them again. Really, it's just, it's just the way it is. So just give it a go. And that's all you have to do is give it a go. And the benefits will be absolutely amazing. All right, well, I hope that's helped you today. I hope that's helped you get back on the wagon. I hope that that has also helped you understand that even though you think you're not getting anywhere, you are. Every time you do facial exercises, you are getting younger and younger every day. It's the truth. So just keep going. You have a lovely day wherever you are in the world, and I'll see you next time. Go Bye. Listen to what Miss Peter says. Listen to what she says. Go listen to what Miss Peter says. Everybody, put on your pretty Peter face. Put on your pretty Peter face. Put on your pretty Peter face. Put on your pretty Peter face.